and I'm Brooke Myers, and welcome, welcome to the second episode of the 2016 season of Panther Tales. Welcome to the girls' room! My name's Amber, and if you look up popular in the dictionary, you'll find me. <laughs> I'm Sheila. Anybody got a problem with that? My name's Tammy, and I'm an exchange student from Tennessee. My name's Elizabeth. <laughs> Your name is Debbie. <laughs> yeah, but if it were Elizabeth, it'd be Elizabeth. <laughs> okay, today's a very special day in the girls' room because it's our first annual Girls' Choice Awards. So the first Girls' Choice Award goes to the worst food served in the cafeteria. And the nominees are Sloppy Joe's, Noodle Coo, Fish Burgers, and Pork Loaf. And the winner is... Velcro! <laughs> Poor clothes! Okay, our next award goes to the best cable TV show. And the nominees are... The Girls' Room, Cooking with Cindy, Panther Tales, Aqua Panthers. And the award goes to... The Girls' Room! the popularest girl in school. Wow, I wonder who that could be. Felcro! <laughs> and the nominees are... Amber. 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 Tina Capone. I'm Tina Capone! I won! I won! I'm sorry, <laughs> Tina could not be here to accept this award. I'm right here. Sheila! <laughs> Here, I'll accept her award on my behalf. All right, that's all the time we have. Remember, I'm popular. I'm Bay. I'm from Tennessee. Velcro. Wow, everybody really worked hard for those awards. Speaking of work, let's take a look at what teachers have done as past jobs before joining our SBA family. I was a retail buyer in Hard Lines, which is Crystal and Home Goods, and I was a stay-at-home mom. I was a political science major, which I use for my government classes particularly every day, and I was an art history major, but really the focus was on critical thinking and reading and writing, and I think those are skills that transfer to any jobs. Uh, I realized I had to be able to multitask really well. I had to do different things all the time and balance a lot of different uh, activities on the job and be able to present to the CEO as well as go into stores. So having to meet so many different people and do different things, I learned how to handle and juggle and do lots of different things well. I went to LaSalle University. college and right after college I waitressed and bartended and I was a banquet manager at a restaurant in Northeast Philly. So I really loved uh, bartending and waitressing and being a manager because it helped me learn a lot of people skills and I'm very organized so I really enjoyed doing that job. So I finished my job at the restaurant because I got my job here at Basil's. This is my first and only teaching job uh, at teaching Spanish. I went to the University of Chicago in Illinois. So just before coming to Basil's or I should say 10 years prior to coming to Basel's, I was a teacher, but uh, before that, I, was, I was a stay-at-home mom for about 10 years, and before that, I was a research scientist at various companies. My favorite part about jobs I had when I was at home raising my children, so I 
I, th I think motherhood is very, very important, or it was a very important part of my life as well. Uh, being in the research world, um, the unknown was the favorite part. Solving for the unknown, yeah. yeah. The teachers had some pretty awesome jobs before SBA, but good thing we have them here now. Another person who has an important job here is our president, Natalie Kakowski. Hmm. I wonder what a day in the life of a student council president is like. So you have a 9 o'clock with Ms. Conte, tutoring at lunch, a 3 o'clock with Ms. Clemente, and 3.10 is your basketball signing, so you use all that. And here's your schedule for next week and your coffee. Coffee? I wanted hot cocoa. Guys, guys, you walk too slowly. So every morning I do announcements in the office and then I go to class uh, and occasionally we have different class meetings so I help to organize them as well. And who helps you out with all your jobs that you do? Joe Biden, aka Mary Kate McKeever, helps me with my day to day tasks and I appreciate it very much. I would just like to say thank you to everyone who like truly made this possible. Um, like my parents from like the very beginning driving me everywhere, uh, just like signing me up for everything, like making sure I always had the best that I could get where I am today. Um, third lunch for really helping me to feel welcomed in this school environment. Uh, it was really weird. Um, for, to my other, um, to my teammates, thank you for always helping me to be my best. Um, <laughs> um, and for making um, practices and games um, much more fun than they would without you. And to Coach Mancini and all my other coaches, um, thank you for helping me to do my best and for making me become a better player and a better person. Oh, Natalie cares so much for our school. Yeah. You know who else cares? SBA cares. Here's Alyssa Braga and Uma Patel showing some of the hard work the volunteers do around the Thanksgiving season. Uh, so Face to Face is an organization that provides meals um, to the homeless. All of their meals are served restaurant style. We've done work with them before where our girls will go and actually serve um, all the guests. Not only providing them with food, but also providing them with human interaction um, and just giving them back um, some of the dignity that they um, many of them so desperately need at that point. The idea for this service project was actually um, born out of an idea that I saw online. Temple University tried to break the Guinness Book of World Record for the largest service project. So they had people, um, volunteers from all over Philadelphia, come into the Lyacor Center and bag uh, lunches for the homeless. And I thought that would be a really cool idea to do here at Basil's, obviously on a little bit of a smaller scale. So we're making peanut butter sandwiches, um, we're putting in water bottles, granola bars, applesauce, and just a little bit a note to to let them know that we're thinking about them. Anyone can join SBA Cares um, for any length of time. That's kind of the, the great thing about it. All you need to do is listen for the announcements. We usually announce our service projects. Um, and then there's a sign-up board outside of the chapel. And we'll always post things out there. We'll post um, Ronald McDonald House dates, LaSalle Academy tutoring dates every other Monday, face-to-face -face dates, um, and then one-off events like this. Just listen for them and sign up, and um, anyone can get involved, and we encourage you to all do it. We love Yay, yeah, yeah. Woo! 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 Woo!
first step. Why do you have a cardboard? Oh, you guys are weird. <laughs> oh, sorry. I just can't get my Spirit Day music out of my head. Me too. I've been practicing all night. Now let's take a look and see how the other dances look. everyone come together for Spirit Day.